An accurate list of companies and contacts is essential to the success of any business. Before adding companies or contacts, you should perform a search to make sure that you are not adding duplicate entries. Search for a specific company by typing part of the name in the company box. The matches will appear below. If it returns as blank, then the company has not been added yet. Now you can safely add the company without creating a duplicate. Click the plus sign Add button. Fill out the form in the General Information window. If you don't have all the information, it's a good idea to go to the company's web page to get the missing information. The account type is not usually used. Select the office from the list on the left that needs access to the company. Then click the arrow to the right to add the office. The county is not required. Complete the address, city, state, and zip code sections. Project Manager and Estimator will be at the assigned level. Click the Save icon when all information has been added. After adding a new company to a job, there needs to be a contact. Click on the Contacts tab. Click the plus sign to add a new contact. The general information form opens. Fill out the information. If you don't know one of the names, enter unknown in the field. Username and password can be assigned if the contact will be using the company portal. If this is the first contact being added for the company, they must be selected as the primary contact. It's a good idea to select this person as my contact as well. This allows you to run reports for that contact. Use the sales information box on the right to enter a marketing rep. You can add the contact to a territory if that information is available. Use the marketing categories window to indicate additional personal preferences of the contact, such as associations, sports teams, church, and so on. Click on the item on the left, then click the right arrow to move the item to the active side. Once the contact is tagged as a referral, the Jobs Referred window will be populated. Click the Save icon. Contact information gets saved to the list. That's how to search for, create, and save companies and contacts in Restoration Manager. Fill out the survey below to let us know if there's anything you'd like to learn more about. And be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more expert tips each week.